We have an update tonight over the lawsuit filed against the state over giving private schools COVID relief funds. A judge has now reached a decision in this case. Fox 23 senior reporter Quinnis Jones has been following the case from the beginning. Quinnis, what has the judge ruled? Good evening. A judge has blocked the state from giving private schools millions in COVID relief funds. We told you a few months ago, the American Civil Liberties Union, also known as the ACLU, filed a lawsuit against the state. It was on behalf of parents for public schools. They say Mississippi is violating the state constitution by giving $10 million in pandemic relief funds to private schools. Now a Hines County judge has ruled in their favor. Now this money is from the American Rescue Plan. It all began back in April when Governor Tate Reeves signed two bills to create the infrastructure grant program for private schools. But this lawsuit aims to block the state from sending these public funds to those private schools for infrastructure projects. The ACLU says the state constitution bans the use of public money for private schools, which makes it unconstitutional. In a statement, the Parents for Public Schools say they oppose the taxpayer dollars being used to support non-public schools. They go on to say taxes are supposed to serve and support the common good. Private schools are not public. Of course, lawyers for the state disagree. They say the funds don't violate the Constitution because the funds were appropriated to the Department of Finance and Administration. No word on if the Attorney General's office Office will appeal this decision. We, of course, will keep you posted on air and online. Cornish Jones of Fox 23 News.